Are you excited? You should be, because we're about to play Excite Bike. <laughs> the amazing Rando. Now this is another one of those NES games that I grew up with, and uh, it's been a long time for me playing this, so I actually had to uh, go out and find a copy of this as the majority of my collection um, well, got sold out from under me. <laughs> oh, good times. But anyway, it's a pretty simple game and uh, it's lots of fun. Selection A is just a solo run. Selection B was uh, racing against uh, NPCs. Yeah, it's a one-player game, unfortunately, but uh, what can you do? Just pass the controller every time you lose, I guess. But here we go. I'm the little red guy. Always found it kind of unfair when they cut me off. Like, ah, oh, but I could cut them off, and that happens. I had to run to my bike after falling off. You know, I just recently discovered that if you mash the uh, B button, you can actually run faster to your bike and get there quicker. I didn't know that growing up. I feel like such a dunce. <laughs> and it also used to bother me when they'd run faster than me or ride faster than me, whatever. Ah! But that wasn't really the point. The point was you were racing against the clock. Those guys were just there to... for reasons. To make it look exciting. You dick! I'll get you for that. In the next round or something. Had he not done that, I'm sure I would have gotten first place. All right, next one. Do do do. Ah! He blocked me from getting away from the mud. The mud slows you down. Slowing down is not cool. Especially when you're racing against the clock and are uncoordinated, apparently. Yeah, buddy! Jump those jumps. Land right. Don't fall down, go boom. And you can also get a little extra boost of speed, but that kind of makes your engine temperature go up and, uh, you know, I don't remember what happens when you let it go for too long. Let's find out. Oh! But yeah, let's find out what happens when you overheat. Ah! You have to sit down on the sidelines and wait. Ah -ha -ha. You crashed too, dick. So, even with me dicking around, I get first place. Cause I'm awesome. <laughs> ah, nighttime race. Or at least that's what you assume when you see blue. Hey, you grape bastard. Ah! Why do they get to stop and I have to roll all the way down the hill? Ah! I nosed down. All 
All right, let's go. What? That's unfair. Dick cheese. Ah! You know, I could probably avoid them by letting off the accelerator, but fuck that. <laughs> Oh, come on. Ha, take that. Bonk, bonk. I love the little speed boost those little ramps gave you. And then I just did whatever by... Oh, I didn't know about... I don't remember that. Ah, uh, again with the not giving a damn. <laughs> I didn't know you could trip over the guys. Whatever. Let's just jump right to track three. Now, for some reason, the color of this track always reminded me of Gatorade. No idea why. Damn it. I almost had that. <laughs> Ding. Whee. Oh, that was close. I would have biffed it for sure, I bet. Aha. Oh, no. Oh, that was close. So if you're slow enough, those won't trip you up. Good to know. Ha! They're always faster than me in getting through their bikes. That always annoys me! Damn it. Damn it! You grape flavored asshole. Oh, that sounds her tor bleh. That sounds terrible. Wee. Take that. Indecisive jackasses. Nope. Whoa, whoa. Nope. Take that, you jackass. Oh, whoa, whoa. Yeah, damn it. Haha. -ha. Let's see, did I win? Nope. They still beat my butt. Either way. The old games are still a lot of fun, and it's... And sometimes it's really good to reminisce about uh, things from your childhood. So, thank you guys for watching this one. If you liked it, let me know by hitting the like button. Leave a comment if you'd like, and... I will see you in the next video. Oh, and don't forget to check out more videos that I've done. And I'll see you in the next one. Hopefully, it'll amaze.